Professor Shawang, AB is the diameter of a circle, APBR. APBR. So this is the cyclic coordinate that we can see. APQ and RBQ. APQ. APQ. And RBQ. RBQ are straight lines. Find PRB, PBR, PPR. What is PRB? PRB. This is the angle which we have to find. PBR. PBR. This is the angle that we need to find. And BPR. BPR. This is the angle. So these are the three angles that we need to find. This is one. How should we do this question? So for the first question. Uh, angle PRB would be equal to 35 degrees Celsius. Uh, 35 degree. Why this would be 35 degree? So because uh, the base of the triangles is equal, the side of the base of the angles uh, of the triangles of APB and PRB, the base of the line is equal. So basically, what you are saying is that in this circle, this chord, PB is a chord. And this yes. chord PB would make the same angle at point A as well as point R. Is this what you were saying? Correct. And because this angle is 35, of course this angle will be 35. Am I correct? Yes. So basically what you were saying is that if this is a chord and this is the chord makes, let us assume this is AB. So the chord makes theta angle at P. Then the chord will make the same theta angle at Q. This is Hibang, do we agree? Yes, sir. So you are absolutely right. This is 35 degree and this is 35 degree. Yeah. What about the rest of the angle? So PRB. PBR. PBR. Yes. Uh, so first of all, the uh, we have to form a triangle. PCB. 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 Triangle PCB. PCB. Okay. So you want an angle to be formed like this. Okay. okay. Yes. So the center angle would be uh, 70 degree. This angle would be 70 degree. Why this will be 70 degree? Uh, yeah. So because uh, the angle formed at the center at the center would be, would be double of that of double. an angle formed at any point on the circumference of the circle. Double. So what you are saying is that if this is 35 degree, this would be 70 degree. Double. Yes. So this angle would be 70 degree. And then, yes. and this then would then. be 70 degree. Therefore, uh, the rest of the two angles would be equal because the radius BC and uh, BC are equal. So the angles would be 55 degrees Celsius, uh, 55 degrees. So what you are saying now is, uh, what I'll do is I'll clean this a bit. Okay. Now let us try to understand what you are saying. This, what is this angle? This is so this would be 35 degrees. 35 degrees. So this is what we have calculated already. Now what you are saying is that this angle, this angle, this angle will be 70 degree. And because in triangle, in triangle BCP, in triangle BCP, this this triangle, in this triangle, because CP, CP and CB, they are the radii, they are the radii. Therefore, this angle would be equal to this angle. Because CB, do we agree? No doubt. So that is why what you are saying is that this is theta and this is theta. Is it correct? Yes. Now, if this is 70 degree, we are left with 110 degree. Half of 110 degree is 55 degrees. Yes. So this angle would be 55 degrees and this angle would be 55 degrees. This is easy to be agree. Yes. Sir. So PRB, PRB is 35 degree. PBR, PB, PBR. That is still to be found because yes. this is. This is what we have found till here, 55 degree. BPR, BP, BPR. This is still to be found. Yeah, Mr. C. Okay. So uh, then what we will do is that uh, angle B, 
uh, what we will do is so so we will take the triangle abq okay. and in triangle abq we have two angles already given to us 35 degree and 25 degree okay now if we add them together we will get 60 degree and 180 minus 60 degree would be 120 degree okay so angle a b q would be 120 degree okay and because angle a b q would be 120 degree and so therefore angle a b r angle a b r would be uh, 60 degree so and angle a b p is 55 degree so therefore 55 degree plus 60 degree would be 115 degree okay so what i'm doing is in this triangle a b q in triangle a b q you already know that this is 35 degree this is 25 degree so this is 60 degree now, out, if I subtract 180 degree out of 60, so A, B, Q, A, B, Q, this angle, A, B, Q. This angle whole is 120 degree, but we are aware that this angle is 55 degree. So, 120 degree minus 150 degree, 10, 5, 5, 11, 5, 6. So, this angle is 65 degree. This is able to be agree? Yes, sir. Now, if this is 65, this is 55, 6, 5, 12. Now, we are left with one. Two. We are left with 60 degree. So, this angle would be 60 degree. Do we agree to this? Yes, sir. See if there is a doubt. Six five eleven. Six five eleven plus one twenty degree, one twenty plus sixty. So this whole straight line is one twenty degree. So we have arrived till here that A B R A B R is sixty degree. Yeah. What next? What we want is P B R. P B R. So P B R would be equal to this angle, which is fifty five. Plus this angle, which is 60, uh, which is 60. So the whole angle would be equal to 115. This is easy to be agreed. Yes, sir. Okay. Next is BPR. BPR. So, so for BPR, uh, what we will do is. See, what I'll suggest is for BPR, you are well aware that this whole angle. Is 60 plus 65. So this is 60. This is 55. This is CB. Are we aware or we are getting confused? Yes. So basically, what I'm saying is that in our previous calculation, what we already know is that angle A B R angle A B R is 60 degree. Angle P B A. PBA is angle P, PBA would be 55 degree. 55 degree. So whole of this angle, whole of this angle PBR, whole of this angle PBR is 115 degree that we had calculated here. Also. So this would be 115 degree plus 35 degree is this angle. This is 35 degree. So when I add all of this and this i get 150 degree i'm left with 30 degree so that is why bpr bpr this angle bpr this angle would be equal to 30 degree this is it correct yes sir. so this angle see there are different ways of uh, calculating the angles now you can do the same question in different ways. So, as long as you are following the rules of uh, circles, any method that you find, any method that you uh, use would be correct. So, this is another way in which you can uh, do the same question. If you like, you can follow this method. Now, if you look at this method, can you see a uh, can you understand how I have done the solution? Yes, sir. See, AB is a dia. They have told you that AB is a dia. Because AB is a dia, therefore APB, this whole angle APB would be 90 degrees. Do we agree to this? 
Yes. Because if this is a diameter, this angle, this angle, so this is a diameter. And this angle is 90 degrees, so this angle is 90 degrees. Do we agree? Yes. Yes. Now, BPQ, BPQ, this is BPQ, BPQ. This BPQ would also be 90 degree. Do we agree to this? Yes, sir. So this angle is 90 degree. This angle is 25 degree. Therefore, PBQ is 65 degree. Do we agree to this? Yes, sir. Because I have considered the triangle PBQ. PBQ. This is a 65 degree. This is 65 degree. If this is 65 degree, then this this hole is a straight line. RBQ is a straight line. If this is 65. This angle would be equal to 115 degree to I agree. Do you agree to this? Yes, sir. Therefore, PBR is 115 degree. Hope this is clear. Yes. yes. Now, this is 115 degree. This is 65 degree. This is 25 degree. Another thing. Now, BA, PAP is already given to be 35 degree. Because this is given to be 35 degree. Of course, this will be 35 degree. This will be, do we agree? Yes, sir. So we have two ways in which we can solve the same question. And both the ways are okay. Don't worry. Maybe when we do the same question the third time, we'll have another way. So as long as, basically what I'm saying is, as long as you are obeying the laws of geometry, as long as you are obeying the rules of uh, the rules and laws of uh, geometry of circles so everything is correct and usually what you need to understand is see there are few things that you need to understand usually whenever they will tell you that this is a diameter you can the first thing that you should always focus on is that this angle would be 90 degrees so this will be to be agree Mr. C B to be agree because this becomes easier. Okay, great. So just remember that the same question can be we have done one plus one way, there can be maybe two other ways, yeah, three other ways in which the same question can be done. Okay.